Are you looking for a simple and tasty way to take your health to the next level? Look no further than kale. In this video, we're going to be diving into 9 amazing health benefits of this nutrient-packed superfood and sharing how you can add it to your diet and where you can get it to buy for consumption as well as the seeds for planting in your backyard garden. Kale can be dangerous for some people, so make sure to watch until the end to find out if you fall into this category. Kale is a dark leafy green that has been in cultivation for so long, dating back over 2000 years and has been so spread across prehistoric traders and migrating tribes that it's so hard to pinpoint the exact region of its origin. Essentially, it is one of the oldest forms of cabbage and belongs to the same family as broccoli, cauliflower, and collards. There are different varieties of kale and the flavors and nutritional content can vary between types. Kale is an excellent source of vitamins and minerals, and this includes beta-carotene, which is an antioxidant that is converted to vitamin A. It is also rich in B6, folate, vitamin C, vitamin K, and the minerals calcium, potassium, magnesium, and iron. The antioxidants that are found in kale can help to fight inflammation in the body and this makes it a great food for preventing chronic diseases. Kale is rich in fiber which aids in digestion and can help to prevent constipation. It also contains prebiotics which can help feed the good bacteria in the gut and improve overall digestive health. Kale is also high in lutein and zeaxanthin, which are important nutrients for eye health. These nutrients can help prevent age-related macular degeneration and cataracts. The high amount of vitamin C in kale helps promote collagen production, which helps to maintain skin firmness and bounce, and it can promote new skin cell production because of its supply of vitamins A and B. Because kale is a low calorie food and it's high in fiber, it's great for weight loss. The fiber in kale can help you feel fuller for longer periods of time, reducing overall calorie intake. The high amount of potassium and magnesium in kale helps support cardiovascular health by regulating blood pressure and reducing the risk of heart disease. The antioxidants in kale can help prevent DNA damage that can lead to cancer. It also contains glucosinolates, which are compounds that have been shown to help prevent certain type of cancer. One cup of kale contains more calcium than a cup of milk and it's also high in vitamin K, which is essential for bone health and it can help reduce the risk of osteoporosis. Kale can be had raw or cooked. You can toss a handful of it into your salads, sandwiches, wraps, homemade pesto, hummus, juices, and smoothies. You can also cut it into small pieces and steam it with other veggies, or just add it to your stir-fry dishes, soups, casseroles, and pasta. You can also saute it with a little olive oil and some onion and garlic, or use it to make homemade oven-baked kale chips, which makes a crunchy, healthy snack. This can be done by sprinkling a little sea salt over its leaves and also a drizzle of olive oil 
and then baking it in an oven at about 275 degrees Fahrenheit on a baking sheet until desired crispness is achieved. This should take about 15 to 20 minutes. Kale is usually found at local grocery stores or farmers markets. It is recommended that you buy kale that is grown organically because it has become one of the newest members of the Dirty Dozen, which is a list of the most contaminated foods. You can get kale chips, capsules, and powder to buy on Amazon as well, which makes it easy to add to your soups, smoothies, and juices. And if you're interested in growing your own food, you can also get kale seeds on Amazon to buy as well. So for those who are interested, I've included a link to the latter in the description below. Consuming too much kale can be dangerous for some people. For example, people who use beta blockers and blood thinners and also people who have kidney disease. Because of this, it's advisable for such persons to talk to their healthcare provider before consuming it. That's it for now guys. Please do your own research and see you in our next video.